You know, the funny thing about these string lights is that they haven't worked in like two years. Hey guys, my name is Luis Rocha. <laughs> Honestly, I love thrifting so much and I haven't gone in like months. But a few months ago, I actually went to this specific thrift store and there was this. This is what I found. And I was like, oh my God, Guy Fieri, what is he doing here? Did he, he lose his wardrobe? Why is it all here? So today, that's my game plan. I need to get the Guy Fieri shirt and I need it now. So you and I and my mom are gonna go on this journey today. So let's go. Three, two, one. So of course I had to make my way to the Guy Fieri shirts first because of, I, I had to and look at this. Look at the madness. I'm not even kidding when I was saying that there was like two, three racks full of these and there's more all the way around the corner that you can't even see. Like did they accidentally mess up their batch order or like what happened? But look, look at them. They're so cool. So as you can see they're from 5thstreetpoker.com if you want to check them out I guess. They also had this red version that I didn't really vibe with but this, this is where it's at. Small size was also XL and then they were $3.99 and you would think by having these like literally they've had these for months you would think that they would like sell them for like a dollar but no. No, they're still sitting here. Anyway, I decided to go shopping around and see what else they have at this thrift store because I love this thrift store. Let me tell you something about this thrift store is a blessing. Every time I come here, I find something. They do have an all sales final policy, which is fine with me because every single time that I get something, it fits me, bro. Anyway, I found these two belts that are cool, but they were like for a child. So they very much did not fit around my waist, but they were cool. Anyway, the jeans is where it's at. I find Levi's here for like six bucks. And let me tell you, every single time that I come here, I find a good pair of Levi's like and they're not bad either they're not worn out or anything they are good and I love this store for this reason but today I was let down because I did not find any that fit me but there was a lot of Levi's though and I am sad that I didn't find anything that's my crotch okay cool <laughs> I'm sad that I didn't find anything today which is fine you know I mean I've been winning here the last few times that I visited it there's my crotch again yep all right what am I doing with my hand okay I guess I'm just giving you guys a bunch of crotch shots today you're welcome and yeah the the shirts kept following me. I kept turning in the corner and they were always there. Something else that I love about this thrift store is there's always like really cool jackets and I love jackets for the winter, but they didn't have anything good today, which was like, whatever. It's good for me because I should stop buying jackets because it's literally summertime. And then we have the dolls. There are so many of these. I put these two together. They're a cute lesbian couple, let them live. And there was this creepy, weird, whatever it is, this stop. And I'm not even kidding when I tell you though, there was like so many of these dolls and these were only like maybe like 25% of the dolls that were there. There was too many, too many of them the art decor area is really nice too they always have like really cool paintings and frames and stuff he's a good guy let him live oh hello that's me but yeah they have a lot of cool stuff in this section this is like my favorite section i want to say they also have a lot of cds and dvds here like a, a substantial amount like i've never seen this many in one place and i go to goodwill and they always have a lot there but yeah they had really good selections like robin good by the veggie tales oh i i love this show and why is this lady putting her hair in a cup anyway there is also this one right over here a personal favorite of mine it is called at the library with mrs i don't know her name but i mean she's a queen also kids bob because of course and yes this video is brought to you by mrs whatever her name is uh her album go check it out it's on itunes this hot wheels thing was actually genuinely really cool it was giving me like y2k vibes and i wanted to buy it because it just it looks so cool i decided not to because i am poor and there's more dolls honestly fuck these dolls fuck them sorry there's so much here and honestly i don't even want to talk about what, whatever this is this was actually genuinely really cute i actually really like this this store has the most weird array of mugs i don't even know what half of these are but honestly like i'm kind of here for it um including this one which I actually no this one i hated i decided to go back to the church just because i wanted to find something for myself today because i at this point i had nothing in my shopping cart absolutely nothing and i thought a few of these were okay but honestly like i didn't really find anything that i loved and guys I want to talk about how stupid I am. So you see those shirts, the Guy Fieri shirts with the flames at the bottom. I decided to get the one freaking shirt that did not have the flames at the bottom. And on this rack, this was like the only one that wasn't the one that I was wanting to grab. And I'm stupid and I don't know why I grabbed literally the incorrect one. But whatever, I don't care. I still put it on, tried it on. Honestly, I was kind of here for it. It kind of looked cool. And I guess I put it over my shirt that I was wearing. I did not want to wear the nasty, dirty thrift shirt on top of my skin because that's nasty. I thought it looked okay. I thought it looked cool. Kind of regret not buying it. I ended up not getting it just because it was really big. And I mean, I had no use for it if I wasn't going to be able to look like him. Look, like that doesn't, it's not the same shirt. 
low key I might go back and get the other version of the shirt because it was cool. And I still ended up trying the blue shirt even though I didn't think I was gonna fully like it and I didn't. It was just too small. I didn't really vibe with it. But it was a cool shirt. And yeah, I did have to put them back which was really sad because I was really looking forward to getting Guy Fieri's shirt. But whatever, it's fine. I'll just have to get it online. And in order to relieve my sadness, I ended up dancing to Luna Flip that in the store. Don't judge me. Why would you judge me? You're a horrible person if you judge me. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed whatever this was. If you want to see more of this, I do have more planned out. Bye. Just kidding. Please subscribe. Also, look at this long neck. Whatever this. Oh, God.